Hey guys, my name is Kitchen and welcome back to my channel. And today's video is going to be in Ulta Hall. It's been a minute. I love me some Ulta. So if you guys love some Ulta too, stay tuned to see what I do. All right. Guys, if y'all already know, this channel is a... It's, it's supposed to be a makeup channel. It's actually, you know... <laughs> so, y'all gonna see some Ulta Hauls on here. So let me show y'all what I got. Anyway... So we're gonna start with the makeup first. And first we're gonna start with this lovely face. And what is the star of the show? NARS. <laughs> you see it's open because baby girl, I used it. I am in the shade Sarah Cruz, if you guys are wondering. And it looks really good on me, by the way. I really like this makeup, it's really lightweight, but it also you can um build it, build a curve, build a book, cover it. Um, yeah, it's I have this on since. 10 a.m. and it's 1 o'clock. So, yeah. That was on right there. <laughs> 1 o'clock. <laughs> Sorry. So, it's only been like a few, not that long, but so far it's really, really good. I really like it. Anyway, um, I needed a new foundation because Lacombe is on some other ish. They done changed their formula. And and the shade range is not shade ranging, okay? My new shade look like I'm 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 two shades dark and baby who's gonna wear that? Cause not I and I wasn't purchasing it. I said, what who this for? Who this for? Cause this ain't for me. Uh-uh. <laughs> Sorry. So baby had to uh go try out a new foundation. I am using also the NYX Blur foundation. I really like them and um now the NARS. And I still like my Holy Grails, the Minta Foundation, and the Black Opal. But I wanted to try something new to broaden my horizons. So, that's that. Alright, so that was the NARS. And then I got me this new setting spray. I usually use um, Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray, the Morphe one, and the Fix It Prime, Prep and Prime Spray. Those are my Holy Grails. Love them, love them, love them. But I wanted to try something new. So, I decided to use this Flower Jet Set. Invisible powder spray child. I ain't use it today because I wanted my makeup to be intact. But I saw it on Instagram, guys. And you know when you get to looking at stuff. I don't know why I'm trying to smell it. I really can't smell that good. It's a small little bottle. <laughs> you know when you get to seeing stuff, you want to try it. At least that's what I do. So I'm going I'm to I'm I'm try it out. <laughs> I'm, I am going to put stuff away as I go. So if y'all hear a lot of moving around, it's just me. But then I got my next items I got was some makeup wipes. I have one pack left. So baby, yeah, I needed to re-up. I got the the mini, the traveling size, the mini ones. And then I got a two twin packs of the Neutrogene Makeup Wipe Movers Fragrance Free. These are the only ones I use. I don't use nothing else. The micellar water I do use too, but I... Really use that. I just rather the makeup wipe. That's just me. I know people like you know anti makeup wipes and they like to do other things, but I'm still the holy grail today. So, all right. And this other item they gave me because um one of the items I purchased came with a gift, and this was the gift. It's called uh the brand is Hourglass. I'm gonna be honest, I ain't never heard of homegirl, but um <laughs> they gave me some mascara, and then they gave me. More mascara. <laughs> okay. And then they gave me primer. Oh, sunscreen. Oh, and this little thing. Comment below if you ever heard of the hourglass ladies. Because uh, you know anybody. And then they gave me airbrush primer. More pr that. So two two things in the prime two primers and two two uh mascaras. Are they different mascaras? Cause they look like they is in different different uh styles i guess because they come in different color boxes we'll see i guess <laughs> i guess i'll check that out i'll put that to the side what if all right we're gonna move along to i guess you could say skin care or hygiene or whatever the hell you want to call it i got me my facial cleanser because um yeah i did <laughs> i was running low on the cleanser part and, um, yeah, so I just purchased it. If y'all ain't know, I went back to my high school days and got me some good old proactive. That's what I've been using to get my face together, honey. This is what I use. So, ooh, 
Okay, camera. <laughs> um, I back in like I want to say the end of 2022. No, the beginning of 2022 and 2021. My face broke out so bad because I was on so many different medications. <laughs> Um, because of my lupus and also stress and weight gain, hormonal imbalances, it's all lovely. So I was breaking out pretty bad. Like, I think I'm going to insert a picture if I have it. If I don't have it inserted here, it's probably because I couldn't find the picture. But if I have the picture and I put it up here, girl, y'all going to see. And I'm going to see my face now. <laughs> Under this makeup, my skin has got completely cleared. It's like, I still have a few, like dark spots but like all my baby girl i got me a good skincare routine going like it's great <laughs> so i just want to let you know my main the main star of the show is this proactive baby and i just i use the original um one i don't there's a new system that they have too but i use the original one i don't go to that one girl stick to stick to what you know i was um i was it was so bad i couldn't use the uh, uh the regular cleanser that i had um, reverted to after I had stopped using proactive and I just stopped using proactive because I feel like I didn't need it anymore I was like, oh, you know, my face is not breaking out as bad, you know I just need a little cleanser to wash my face and it was fine But like I said when I had got uh, diagnosed lupus and everything started going in Girl, them breakouts was real <laughs> So if you have like really bad acne or like you're starting to get hormone acne or anything like that, girl, try out some breath. I'm telling you, boo. I know the whole new wave is curology. I think that's the thing. But baby, I ain't got 20,000 months to do that. <laughs> I'm going to get this and it's going to work for me and it worked for me. So that's what I'm going to stick to. But I'm never knocking nobody who does that. I've heard of it. And I was really desperate was about to try it. But then I thought to myself, my financialness is not going to do that. <laughs> so stick to what you know. But, um, moving along, another skincare item I got was my lovely, lovely body scrub. So, I got these Dr. Teal's Shea Sugar Scrub, Shea Butter, and Almond Oil one. I love sugar scrubs. If y'all don't know, no. I could even put a few of my friends on to some sugar scrubs. I'm telling you right now, y'all, get to the sugar scrub baby. I know some of y'all be doing it naturally. That's what's what that's what's good. I think my mom does it naturally too. I think. I don't know. I think so, because she be telling me to do it natural, so she probably do. I don't know. But the other one I got, I got a vanilla scent. I never had vanilla. Yeah, I can't wait to try that. <laughs> this is the vanilla scent one. If it focused, child, like dang. Don't embarrass me. Alright, thank you. <laughs> And this other one I got. Some of these scents I never tried out. So I'm really excited to try them. This one is Bikini Reef. Yeah, I never tried this one. This one. And then I think I got one more, Jeff. Hold on. Yeah. And this one is Rose from Dr. Teal's. So I got four sugar scrubs. I wanted to get more because I'm really low. Like, I think I got one left to use. So I really needed to go buy some and I'm glad I do. And then another skin product I got. Well, I would say it's like a skin product. It is going with skin. Girl, I got this Mega Man Friction Fighter. And if y'all know about y'all plus size women that be chafing, baby, this for you. <laughs> y'all know what chafing is when them thighs rub together when them body parts. <laughs> friction <laughs> okay and then and you get them like inner thigh bugs because it's been rubbing again it's been rubbing together thick thighs save life but they rub baby they burn when it when it when it when it gets when it gets to rub it so i advise you <laughs> to try this out i did have a thigh the thigh one but girl i hadn't used it all and i was like oh let me just try the one that is not just for thigh you can just put it anywhere and i know some people like girl you can just use a little powder but powder is messy and i don't have time to be messy especially if i'm wearing certain clothing and what's the other one deodorant again that's messy <laughs> and i don't have time to be ruining my clothes while i'm trying to go somewhere so it's just this like wax stick it's pretty it's pretty good i had used the thigh one i really really liked it although i wish they give you more product in here because girl i be using this up child i be using in the summertime i never use it because when i'm wearing them shorts and my thighs be chafing come in handy so check this out it's called mega man mega man i was about to call mega babe 
Um, yeah, friction brighter. And it's, ooh. It's unscented. And it's with vitamin E and pomegranate. Ooh. Girl, look, look. Reading is fundamental. Because I definitely didn't know that. <laughs> the next skincare item. I would say this is the last skincare. Well, the next one is, yeah, yeah I would say too. Black girl sunscreen. And it is black on child. Not just saying it because it's black girl sunscreen. Saying, but it is black on. I really, 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 really like it. And I'm really, really done with this one. It's nothing but air in this child. <laughs> so... This is definitely a good sunscreen. They do have a spray on there and they have one, um, I have another one with more SPF in it, I believe, but I really like this one. It works really, really well for me. I have used this when I went to Jamaica, use it, um, this summer I didn't really go nowhere or do much, but when I went to Jamaica last year and, um, I used it the whole trip and it worked wonders and I even used the spray, so... Definitely check them out. Really, really good. It's not too greasy. And it's not, um, I'm trying to think of the word. Yeah, it's not too greasy or oily. It's, it, it's pretty good. Because you know how some sunscreens be really greasy and oily? You be like, dang, girl, I'm shiny. I ain't trying to be that shiny. Yeah. It ain't like that. But the next skincare item on the last one would be these. The Diana's Goat Milk Hand Lotion. Girl, if you ain't not put people on, I ain't put my mama. She even texted me like, girl, give me that little shit from there. Um, <laughs> I had to order hers off Amazon because after I had ordered this, I had been got this. I was like, dang, my, yeah, yeah, I've been got these, all this stuff in August too, y'all. And my last haul, I had shot a video and I said I had got all this stuff in August and I did, y'all. I'm so late. I know. It's okay. And by the way, I know I didn't say this, but anything I did purchase will be in the description box below, guys. Guys, so y'all can just go in there, press the link, and it will go right to the item that y'all want to look at. But yeah, this I love these. These are different scents. I never had any of these scents before. I, I'm lying. I had vanilla bean, but I never had the lavender vanilla, the crisp pear, the white jasmine and shea, and the sugar berry. And I cannot wait to use them. Ugh, oh my gosh, because you girl hands be ashy, child. They be ashy. If you wash your hands a lot, even though you work in office, girl, still wash your hands. Them computers and everything. Why is my computer a keyboard, but still, you never know. You get up, touch file, do something. It's just, mm -mm. <laughs> So, I advise you wash your hands, put some lotion on. These are really, really, really good. Lightweight, again, they're not greasy, and they actually do good. They do keep away the ass, child, so definitely check them out. This whole set, though, was 20 beans, baby. They did have one that has four other scents in them that were $40. I should have got that one because I really, really like these, and I want to uh, stack them up because I really like them. All right. The next item is just one hair item. And it's just this TGI, and I'm going through this haul very quickly, y'all. I don't know, did I get much? No. The next items I got was for my man, but I already gave it to him, so I ain't even going to put them in there. <laughs> um, this next item is black-owned as well. It's the TGI in Miracle Repair Protective Leave-In Conditioner and Baby. This is the GOAT. Like, if y'all didn't know, your girl suffered from alopecia back a few months ago. It was so bad I had to cut my hair bald. <laughs> and I think I did a video of that. So, um, I was, uh, the medication I was taking for one of my, uh, one of the medications I was taking for my lupus, excuse me, um, made me get alopecia. So I was losing my hair. And it was so bad. And it was so uneven. So my sissy just shaved it off. Now it's growing back. It's pretty good. And I use a set of products that are just minimal. I notice like with my hair, less is better. <laughs> like you don't have to put so much products and different things in my hair to make it grow. One simple routine, you may switch it up here and there or do something different. Like do a hot oil treatment or da-da-da-da or do like a deep condition do da 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 like that stuff like that but consistently doing that every here and there and not just switching up and do all types of mess that's gonna tamper and sometimes tamper when you hear it too much will mess it up so i have found me a good routine and one of the products that i really love is the tgin i use their conditioner as well i don't use their shampoo the shampoo i use i use a medicated shampoo because sometimes i get sores in my hair from lupus and i use uh <sighs> Oh my gosh, 
I forget the shampoo that I use, but it's um in one of my other Ulta hauls, y'all. But I use the, um, the other shampoo that I use and the medicated one. That's it to wash my hair, and then that the conditioner is TGIN and the leave-in conditioner is TGIN, and that's it. And then I use a moisturizer cream from TGIN. That's it, and coconut oil. <laughs> It in my hair like literally I don't I don't put all the times anymore because like I notice less is good for me but this is black owned and they and it really works y'all like my hair was breaking <laughs> and it was bad so try this out if you guys want to find something new or you want to like dip into some of the different hair products and you're a natural if you're a natural you know I don't know if it works if you're not natural I mean hey I mean, you can read up on it but I'm gonna excuse me, my hair is natural. I haven't had a perm in years and yeah, so I like it. The last couple of items were basically just nails. If y'all know your girl wears press on nails, if you don't know, y'all ain't know. Surprise! <laughs> so Halloween is coming up, baby. So I got me some glow in the dark kiss um Halloween nails. And I thought this was really cute. I'm actually going to do a Halloween makeup look, y'all. In one of these videos in the near future coming out. And I want to wear these nails with it. So, yeah. That's why I really got them. I'm not really into Halloween like that, though. So, But I just wanted to do that. And I really do like those nails. I thought they were cute. The next of the nails, y'all got to get you a red nail. I got a couple of red ones in my drawer already but I saw these ones and this girl I read the reviews and this girl was like these are like really really cute and this type of red I'm trying to show y'all so y'all can see you see the red it's these Marilyn Monroe um red nails they're short I really I really I really like the color red on my nails and my toes and my next color my toe is going to be red so when I do that I'm going to bust these out and put them on I really got those, and hey, yeah, that was know. it for my Ulta haul. Short and sweet. I mean, it's not that short. It's about well, like, uh, 16 minutes. <laughs> not that long, but y'all, those are the items I got. Don't forget to like this video if you like Ulta or you just like makeup or girl, just like the video. Shoot. <laughs> Don't forget to comment below what is your favorite item or what item you want to try or what item you already tried and you want to just talk about because baby, what I, I, I talk. I'm really cool. <laughs> And don't forget, if you caught this vibe with me, if you caught this vibe, you might as well, you might as well subscribe. Thank you.